guys. So I, sorry if I'm quiet, but I am pumping, so ignore the noise. But Violet is six months old. And we had her will baby check today. And she is doing good. She's crazy as ever. She is so much like Carson that it's like, wow. <laughs> It's crazy how much I've forgotten from when he was a baby, but she is quickly reminding us. Um, she is into everything. She just, she's into everything. She wants to be going and exploring and doing and touching and feeling and putting things in her mouth and just, she's, she's a busy girl. <laughs> um, she's 18 pounds, 8 ounces. She's 27 inches long. She can sit up by herself. Um, she's crawling. She can push back to sitting almost. She um, she's done it once, but for the most part, she just like props herself on one arm and then keeps going. She is doing really well, fitting in with the big kids. They are really sweet with her. They um, you know it. They know that if you know. They've got, she's got one of their toys or something that they can't just rip it away from her or things like that. They, they'll they go and bring her something else that, that she can play with to distract her and then, you know, just, they're doing really well with her. Um, Paisley, we've had, we've got two crawling babies right now because Paisley broke her leg on a trampoline last week and um, she didn't fall off of it or anything. It was an innocent accident. She's, um... But uh, I'm sure you know somebody with a trampoline accident story of their own. But uh, anyway, she she's crawling around. Um, so it's funny to have two, two crawling babies who are completely dependent on you for anything mobile. Um, I guess I can update on her too. since. We, but anyway, we um, Paisley's completely potty trained. Um, both in the house, out of the house, overnight, you name it. She has been in panties since um, the beginning of November. And since she broke her leg, um, she it, it hurts to the way you have to position her, make sure no TT gets on her cast, that kind of thing. Um, we've convinced her to let us put her back in diapers because she was having accidents, like purposely, so that we could just change her and we just decided to make it easier for her that we would just we asked her if she would rather a diaper and at first she was like no and that was fine so you know we didn't force it but it hurts her too bad right now um she's not allowed to walk on it at all any pressure on it whatsoever um besides crawling so until she's more mobile um we're just going to keep the diapers on her so and that's fine she wears the same size the ball it does anyway so um, I don't know. I've never had to deal with going backwards potty training, but she still tells us every time. She's she's always like, Mommy, I'm going TT in my diaper. So then we just take it off and, and, and go again. So I think I'd be nervous if she stops communicating that, but she's fine. Um, as far as that goes, the doctor expects a full recovery. He said, um... You know, I told him, I said, I, I feel bad because, like, how, you know, I don't know, you might or might not know, Carson also broke his leg when he was two and a half, and um, I was like, how is this, are we the only ones this happens to? And he was like, oh my god, no. He's like, it is so common. You know, people say that kids' bones don't break that easy. He's like, that's just not true. He's like, I, it's just not true. Um, so that made me feel better. He's like, don't feel bad at all. He's like, kids, they have fun. They are, they do things all the time. Um, you know, he's like, don't worry about it. I broke a lot of bones when I was a kid, too, and I, I don't know. Some people I know have never broken a bone in their life, but, um, my mom just laughs. She says it's payback, but, uh, anyways, so that's that. Um, yeah, that's really all that's going on right now. I'm obviously at work, um, pumping in an extra empty office. And I just got done working my ass off for the last two weeks. Um, 
and they just rewarded us with a few days off with pay so that was super nice so today's been my first day back and it's kind of like oh, you need a vacation after the vacation but I'm excited to know that I'll be going home at 5 o'clock today with everyone else instead of wondering what's for dinner and what delivers to the office so um, luckily my job is not always like that it's um, very randomly we'll get a project with a super strict deadline um, but anyway so that's a little bit of a random vlog um, Carson starts t-ball on Tuesday he has his first game and um, Paisley will obviously have to take a little time out from the little gym but I'm excited that once she can get you know back into that that it will help her it's kind of like a therapy to help build the strength back in her leg and um, anyway so she's doing good and everyone's doing well so we'll uh, talk to you later bye